Hi Cancerian, welcome to my channel, welcome back to my channel, Trying Divine Tarot. I'm trying, I'll be reading for you today. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel, I greatly appreciate that. Don't forget to hit that notification bell, I'll let you know every time I upload a video. Alright, I missed you guys, how y'all doing? I'm going to start with two overall messages, this will be a love reading for the Cancerian, okay? Alright, oh, there's one. Ew. Oh my gosh. Ooh. <laughs> well, the devil card wanted to show out. So, somebody's being a little mischievous. Somebody's being a little. Somebody's being a little devil. Well, let's see what the other card is. Ooh, a lion. So, somebody might be lying. Or somebody. Is, I'm feeling like there's a masculine energy very present here you could be dealing with a Capricorn you don't have to be but somebody has like a little obsession with something okay <laughs> or somebody's being very prideful somebody's being very possessive somebody is very territorial at this moment and I believe it has to do with their person okay Somebody's very obsessed over their person at this time, and I'm feeling a little envious energy. I'm feeling like a little jealousy, and I'm feeling like, yeah, territorial, like, like somebody that's like very possessive okay like that's mine <laughs> okay you know come for it and find out what happens to you okay so we have the lion came out like this we have the lion and then we have the devil here so we'll dig deep into this somebody is really hot and bothered over the person they want to connect with okay like brink of obsession and they're like really horny for their person too okay <laughs> let's read the cards it says lion harness the loyal and protective aura of the lion and charge ahead magnificently so somebody wants to take control of a situation i feel like it's a masculine energy and um they really want their person they really, fire and desire is here big time, all right? And they might be doing something a little devious or mischievous in the background to make sure that no one enters the ring for their person. Because I don't know if this is a relationship that is established. Um, but they're making sure that what belongs to them, what they feel it belongs to them, stays with them, okay? All right, we have double. Take care immediately to avoid temptation or deceit. Okay, so reading that with the lion. All right, you can be dealing with a Leo. You don't have to be, or... Take heed to avoid temptation or deceit. What would deceit be? Maybe somebody's lying. All right, let's see. <laughs> what is this for the Cancerian regarding Cancerian's relationship? Single or in union? Let's see. All right. We have some sort of message, some sort of information, some sort of documentation, okay? Seven is the number of heaven, so this was something divinely... Uh, guided d d some something is being brought to somebody's attention here okay some sort of message was found somebody was I don't know somebody was in somebody's inbox and found something that they didn't like all right somebody found out the truth regarding something and now somebody's in despair probably because they were just exposed or they're in despair because um, of what they read what they see okay a message of concern all right so something that 
made somebody feel a little bit guarded, made somebody um, somebody was a little taken back by what they saw. Okay. We have a mature man that also wanted to fall out. Hold on one sec, please. Hi, Cancerian. Sorry for the interruption. Okay. So, somebody was a little taken back by what they saw, what they uncovered, what was revealed, but it was spiritually guided to happen this way. All right, somebody could have been lying, somebody could have been hiding something, somebody could have been a little devious or mischievous. I'm saying that with this devil card, okay? What is this devil regarding? Okay, it says a privileged lady. Okay, so, and then, I mean, this is the Empress card in traditional tarot. Okay, but also with the two and the, the one and the two, that's a three. And three represents marriage here. So, as you can see, her counterpart is not in the picture. But somebody wants to be married. Somebody wants to be commit, have a commitment. Somebody, somebody does want that for their future, wants to come in union, but somebody hit the brakes. Or there is somebody on somebody's mind, all right, that they're not making known. And they might be crushing on this feminine, all right? They have deep feelings for this feminine. I mean, this is <laughs> Empress energy. So she gets a lot of onlookers. She gets a lot of chasers. Um, and there's a lot of competition for her, okay? She is the queen of all queens. She is the earth mother, all right? She's abundant. She's She makes things grow. She's happy within herself. She eludes this energy that draws you in, okay? And somebody's been drawn in. <laughs> um, or this might be somebody's partner that they have, are attached to. And, you know, I don't know if you're married to this person or in a long-term connection or whatever it is, but somebody is coming for somebody's person okay and this masculine energy is like you know fuck around and find out <laughs> all right let's see what else is going on one more okay this was at the bottom of the deck all right initially and i flipped it over um but it wanted to be seen. So this is the mature woman. So something from the past that happened a while ago is affecting somebody's relationship, okay? Or somebody's trying to mess around with someone from their past. And I also feel like someone is in love with somebody's girlfriend or somebody's in love with somebody's boyfriend, okay? That you might know from your past. All right, okay. <laughs> what are the love messages for the Cancerian? Okay, I can't express myself. So somebody's crushing hardcore on somebody, but they're not letting it be known. They're keeping their feelings to themselves. They can't express their feelings. And it's probably because they're attached to some someone else. Like somebody's crushing on somebody that's already in a relationship. Okay, another one. Lover message for the Cancerian. Why do I deserve someone like you? Okay, so somebody is putting someone on a pedestal. Okay, or somebody put somebody on a pedestal. Um why do I deserve someone like you? Somebody like really loves and admires the person that they're with or who they want to come into connection with.
Why do I? I'm, I'm okay. <laughs> Why can't I tell you the truth? I told you. Uh, see, somebody's lying about something. Somebody's lying and it's affecting somebody's relationship. I don't, I don't know where to start. I'm scared of rejection. Okay. So either this is a newer connection that somebody's like desiring and crushing hardcore on somebody but they're not coming forward. They need to be courageous. They need to be brave and make the move. Um, but what they're doing instead is being devious in the background and making sure um, that nobody comes for what they desire, for what they want. And they're doing some bullshit in the background. And when it comes to light, this person might not, and finds out what kind of like devil this person was being in the background. This person might turn their back on them, okay? Because somebody's doing something in the background to stop a connection because they're too afraid to come forward with it, okay? Also, they might not think that they're on this person's, you know, they might not be their equal. They might not have the same, you know? Somebody might not um, feel like they have what it takes to really be with this one, okay? Um, I'm feeling like <laughs> like somebody feels like, you know, you're just an average person. Uh, it, let's If I'm like in masculine terms, like somebody's just like an average person, like crushing on like Brad Pitt or, you know, like Angelina Jolie, you know what I'm saying? Somebody feels just like a commoner and then somebody sees their person as this and it's intimidating and it's nerve wracking and they see that this person gets a lot of attention, that she, this person might have other options, but they're trying to like, in a lack of a better word, like they're trying to cock block <laughs> someone until they're ready to come forward, until they're ready to, you know, harness the energy of the lion and move forward. I'm feeling like this is a masculine energy. Okay. Another one for the kids, Syrian. Okay. No one understands me but you. All right. So somebody's formed an attachment or a connection of an, an obsession unbeknownst to somebody else, I feel. This person, you know, this it could be a, like somebody's in the public eye. Somebody has like a public platform. They're being able to use. I feel like this is like somebody crushing on somebody in the background. If this is like regarding like the singles, if this is somebody that's already in a, an established relationship, somebody is a little envious or jealous of their partner and they value their partner dearly but they will do what they have to do to protect their relationship and if they got to get evil they will get evil all right <laughs> all right so let's get into this what is the advice for the cancerian let's put that right there okay let's get that in view all right, the devil energy here. All right, for the Cancerian. What's the advice for the Cancerian? You know, somebody needs to start operating out of their north node instead of their <laughs> south node, okay? i am also been guided to say something like that. All right, we have the Eight of Cups, all right? So... The Eight of Cups is moving forward. The Eight of Cups is um, somebody that's breaking a lot of hearts, I'm feeling. All right, these are cups that have been filled and spilled and can't be refilled. But somebody's moving forward. Somebody's moving forward to their Ninth Cup, okay? The Nine of Cups is wish fulfillment. So 
somebody's moving towards a feminine energy with that moon, but they're making their moves in silence. Cancerian, you are the moon energy. You know, you share that energy with your buddy Pisces, but somebody's in the background. Somebody wants a relationship to come into fruition and they're leaving behind um, some sort of way of thinking, way of behavior in order to get what they want, okay? So they're on their journey to their to operate through their north node, okay? They're finally following the north star and um, going to make that track to find the shoreline, all right? That three of wands where you make it to the shoreline after going through the deep, dark forest okay and finding your way out to the other side to the shoreline where you stand there as a lighthouse as a beacon of light and you're able to call your ship towards you okay the ship is filled of your wish fulfillment what you've been hoping wishing and praying for but you have to do the work to get it you have to do it in the right way okay all right i think i'm going to leave that there for the cancerian i hope this message helped you Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. I greatly appreciate that. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. It lets you know every time I upload a video. Okay, till next time, baby dolls.